Weather's great, springtime, everything. How's the how the practice is going for you out there? Uh, real well. Um, just other than this being hot and Coach Joe pushing everybody but walking on the field, everything else is going real well. But when was the last time you've been hit? Um, I think about two, three years ago, my first game of my senior year. So it's been about two years, two years and a half. Uh huh. Um, coach said the quarterbacks won't be touched during the spring and everything. So mm -hmm. you, you feel like you're ready for contact. You can get out there and, and, and be the player you, you've been. Yeah, just knowing my body, um, I did. I think I did a real good job of, and the uh, rehab people did a real good job of helping me kind of get back to myself and just kind of trusting my body again. So I think my body will be ready. Um, I think the first couple of times, just getting the butterflies out and just getting used to it, but I think I'll be ready. Mm -hmm. Walk us through what, what this Coach calls it, you know, this, this competition that, that it kind of brings out the best in all three of you guys. What, what's it like from, from a player's perspective? I'm just trying to be consistent and be better than the person you was the first practice. Um, so, like, me personally, I just try to focus on some of the mistakes I made and just kind of go back and kind of clean them up and fix those things. So if you can kind of constantly be better than the person you was, then uh, everything else will take care of itself. When, when you look at all, all three guys out there kind of, you know, work, working towards that, that quarterback spot, what what do you see from from all three guys that that you guys each do well, and kind of a, a different like a unique aspect that y'all bring to the table? So like I said, uh, everyone's unique in their own way. Uh, Justin has his things; he's great at. Miles has his things; he's great at. And I have my things; I'm great at. So, coach is trying to find a way of, of getting us in all the positions that we can be at the best at at all times. So, just a matter of just kind of putting the pressure on the coaches of finding a way to get us all on the field. So we're just trying to work together and help each other. Well, you feel like you're a true, a true a dual threat. I mean, you can run, you can pass, you can do all those things. Um, I'm a quarterback. Um, I'm, at the end of the day, I go out here and have to make decisions. I have to lead the guys. So I don't really consider myself being those type of things. So whatever coach asks me to do, that's what I do. You said it's been so long since you've been hit. You nervous at all for the, the first one? Nah, I mean, like I said, I, I probably took care of myself. Um, I lost a lot of weight. I've eaten already. I'm still rehabbing myself. So I think I'm prepared for whatever comes. What are you weighing right now? 228. As opposed to? 243. Yeah, I, I, I was real out of shape when I first got here. So it took me a while to kind of get back to myself and kind of change my eating habits. But I think I'm doing a real good job at it now. And the bad eating habits, what had to go? My favorite thing was McDonald's. Uh, just kind of eating hot and spices and french fries and, and all those things. Uh, so it's just a matter of just knowing what to eat and the certain portions that, that you can eat of it. The 99 cent menu. Yeah, this is real cheap. So, <laughs> <laughs> so um, how do you feel like uh, has your passing improved? I mean, have you refined your game since you got here? Yeah, I think when I first got here, it was just a matter of confidence. I just kind of, it was my first time really playing football again since about eight months. So just kind of being in a new environment, just still trying to figure yourself out. So it took me a while to kind of get my confidence back, but. It was some things I had to work on. Uh, I had to work on my, my quick game, uh, my drop back, and just being consistent all the time. I would imagine that your inner strength and character really has been built over these last several years between the knee injuries and waiting to get on the field and everything. How much do you think you, you, you've grown and learned patience and those kind of things? Uh, it took a while just, just kind of understanding the process, you know. Everything is a process. So I know I had to, you know, last year I knew I wasn't ready to play just coming off my injuries and just knowing that, I haven't thrown the ball in what about four to six months and expect to come out here and be the best guy. So just understanding that I have to work on myself and just to kind of be ready for this position that I'm in now. How much different is it now with, with Steve out there kind of calling the plays and learning a little bit of the, the new system this year as opposed to what, what you guys had last year with Canada? Uh, I think Canada did a great job with us last year. Um, I think we was led the country in the least amount of turnovers. So that was something he, he was big on, uh, us taking care of the ball and getting the ball out of our hands. Uh, of course, Steve is the same way. Um, he's just trying to figure us out right now and trying to figure us out as an offense um, of what we like and what we can be successful and be consistent at. So, I mean, I love both guys. As a quarterback, is, is it fun to know that maybe this year, their, uh, year you guys might branch out, you know, go three, four, five wide with some of these uh, big physical wideouts you guys have? Um, definitely. Um, all quarterbacks like throwing the ball. So whatever it takes for our offense to win, that's, that's what we're willing to do. How do you describe some of these these wideouts? It seems like uh, there's some big guys out there, Stephon Sullivan, some of these other dudes, or Drake Davis, big kind of like freakish, tall wide receivers. Does that, does that give you guys some confidence? Behind uh, definitely. Them? Um, all those guys are big, 6'4", 6'5". We can run fast and jump high. So we just kind of 
put them in kind of put them in tough situations in practice to see if they can go out there and make plays for us. So, so far they've been doing a really good job. So we plan to continue doing that. Normally early on we see like kind of the, the defense usually is got, got kind of the upper mm -hmm. upper leg. Have you guys been putting the pressure on on them recently? Yeah, uh, we kind of changed a few things up and just kind of get them off, uh, give them some new looks. So um, Devin White does a great job. Uh, Greedy does a great job in the secondary, and Rashad handled his defensive line real good. So we're just kind of trying to figure out and be consistent in what we do and just kind of keep those guys off balance.